rest or two. Weary and burdened, and I will give you rest. Take my yoke upon you and follow me. Take my yoke upon you and learn from me. For I am gentle and humble in heart, and you will find rest for your souls. The Bible is always giving us examples that simple folk will understand. But around here, we don't have any mustard bushes or fig trees or grapevines or vineyards or wine presses, at least not in any number. But what we do have is pecans. <laughs> Left to themselves, pecan trees will overbear. Too much fruit on the branch. So much so that even a rain breeze will crack the bough, meaning you lose both the crop <laughs> and the tree. Well, our lives are like those trees. We need to go through and pluck away those things in our lives that initially look beautiful. But in the end, just weigh us down. Whatever it is, we need to trim it away. And if we do our part, God will do his part by strengthening the bow. John 10.10, 10, I have come that you might have life and that you might have it abundantly. Amen? Amen. I'm climbing up on the rough side of the mountain. I'm going to hold on his powerful hand. I'm climbing up on the rough side of the mountain.